Hi, everybody. Um, <laughs> wow, what a Monday. Um, I take a commuter train into work and back home, and it's usually a 29-minute commute. And I don't know why, but there's this, like, really wacko, bizarre trend of people um, getting hit by trains on the train tracks. So I'm just wondering, you know, what's going on? Um, it, there, I think this is, like, the fourth or fifth person um, from the summer when I started taking the train to, to even tonight. And tonight it was just a complete disaster. Uh, someone got hit and was uh, killed by a train on the line going westbound and I go eastbound. So of course I expect some minor delays um, with the trains. This happened at like 11 or one o'clock or something like ridiculous in the morning. Do you know it is now 7.15 and I'm just getting home now and the only reason I'm home now is because I chose to take a taxi and pay money out of my own pocket. Otherwise, I probably would still be standing on the platform. They delayed my train. They canceled my train. Uh, they sent another train 25 minutes later that wasn't big enough. Um, so people were just left stranded. They were angry. They were yelling. They were screaming. It's just unbelievable. So you would think uh, that the, the people that run this commuter service would have some kind of insight um, in, and some kind of contingency plan, but they obviously do not. So um, anyway, regardless, I'm home, be it, let's see, what are we, an hour, hour and 45 minutes late? Yeah, an hour and 45 minutes later than I'd normally get home. I feel like garbage because the taxi driver was doing this the whole time because there was tons of traffic. So I was just like, boo. I actually said to him, you got to open the windows because if you don't, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hurl. And I said hurl. So, yeah. But anyway, the real reason for this video, and it's going to be very short, um, is that I went to the Dior counter today. And I got this lovely little bag. I saw my good friend, Anne. Um, so this video has a happy ending, which is great. Um, even though I still feel like I'm kind of going to puke. So uh, the holiday collection is in Toronto. It is in Canada, which is great. So I only picked up two things. I picked up the Celebration uh, Collection eye palette, which I'm not going to open for you, but I will show you um, the back of because it's got a picture. This is like your standard kind of everyday smoky eye. They've actually got the base, um, a base here for your um, eyeshadow, and then the eyeliner is here, and then the three colors. You also get a uh, mascara and a liner and, and then the uh, applicator. And then I got, I'm sorry, I've got to watch my puppy over there. Um, then I got a Diorific in 039 Lady, the long wearing true color lipstick. And I love this packaging. I think it's adorable. There it is. And it's just a very pretty pink. The other colors were nice. It's more of a red, reddish pink. But um, the other colors were more red. And I have lots of reds. But I really like this and I like the packaging. So I thought, let me get one. I may be going back for the nail col nail polishes. I believe it was Lipstick Vanessa that had said that she wasn't overly impressed by it. And I think she had said especially the nail polishes. Um, the colors aren't really anything that's really wowed me. But I do like the bottles. I do like the fact that they look like bulbs and ornaments. I think that's really cute. So I may pick one up. I may skip it. I'm not sure. So yeah, that's it. My crazy Monday evening commute home and um, a happy ending with my Dior haul. So I uh, thanks for watching. Hope your Monday went better than mine um, getting home anyways. And like, comment, subscribe. I'll do the same. Thanks. Bye.